hello everyone welcome back to my channel jp khasi tech so if you are new to my channel please don't forget to subscribe now let's start the project first of all just check it out in the xml file i don't have anything so i have only one text view just displaying name nothing else so let's go directly to the java let's make a method here private void i'm gonna call it load dialog so I'm going to use the alert dialog dot builder ad new alert dialog dot builder and the context will be this. Let's set the title for the dialog ad dot set title. And the title will be welcome. Close it. Next, set the message. I'm going to say hey I'll just close it next let's set the button for the cancellation purpose so I'm going to say set positive button here inside the parameter first define the name for the button so I'm going to call it yes outside give comma and then here you define the dialect interface so I'm going to say new dialect interface and then you select this one on click listener okay now you can see this is the on click listener for the dialog and just close this with semicolon i'll change this variable dialog interface as you want so i'm going to change now whenever the button in the dialog box is clicked i want that the dialog box must be dismissed so copy this one press here and call dot dismiss now let's load this dialog box Whenever the apps is start for the first time, just go here on click method and let's create a share preference. Share preference SP, which is the share preference equal get share preference. Now here we have to define the string name and then mode type. So name I'm gonna give simple JP comma and then mode is private. Close it. Let's define the boolean here bln which is the variable of boolean equal now copy the variable of share preference sp and call method get boolean okay here we have to define the key and then the value so the key i'm going to use once comma and then the value will be true for the first time close it now make a condition if it is true okay and come inside and then load the dialog box this one if it is true say load dialog box and at the same time change the boolean value to false so that the next time whenever the apps will launch the dialog box will not be appear again because the value will be safe in the share preference copy this one again and then press here and then also change this one to sps now in order to put the value inside the share preference we need editor share preference dot editor and then the variable i'm going to call it simply editor equal now take the variable of share preference this one copy and then paste here or you can type now just edit close it let's put the boolean value into the share preference with the help of this editor now copy the variable of editor paste here and then call a method dot put boolean okay here we have to put the string type and then the boolean so the string is same as given here this is once okay once come outside and then the value this time we are going to put false close it now again paste the variable of editor and call dot apply now let's go down below again here outside of this button click type ad dot show close it now run the project and see if it's work the app has run successfully for the first time and you can see the dialog boxes appear for the first time it says hey this app was created by jp kasitek now let's cancel this close it and then let's run for the second time that dialog will not be shown again it's work perfectly guys thank you so much for watching please do subscribe have a nice day